What up, what up, what up? This is the real Rick Ross, and you listen to me on the Murder Master Music Show. Don't turn that down. Only support the real. Clothing line coming out and everything. Um, what's the latest, uh, you know what I'm saying, with uh, the rapper? Uh, I heard that he dissed you. What? Uh, why is he fi- Why do you think he's firing at you now when he was silent for years? Well, he he he's he's seeing that I've been overshadowing him in so many so many areas that that he had to uh, go on the offensive. Uh, he called me an informant on his record. Uh, yeah. So he he said I think they said, I I never I don't listen to I don't I, I heard a couple of his records on the radio but I I would never listen to his album. Uh, yeah, I never listened to good. Dick Toss and Gay Back music ever. Me either. <laughs> none of his artists and none of them motherfuckers. Yeah, because it's, it's 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 crazy, you know, to, to have somebody lying and and then you're gonna listen to it as if it's true. But anyway, you know, and some people some people believe what he said. You know, that I I sent forty uh, people to prison. I testified on forty people and sent them to prison for life. And I'm like, how could that be possible with with technology today? You know, and not one person. Not one person has went on the internet and said, "Hey, I'm the guy that Rick told on. Here's my paperwork." Uh, yeah. So, That's so you know, I don't, right I don't, there. I don't pay, I don't pay no attention to nothing he says uh, or, or do. You know, uh, um, I want to see. You know, he he has a serious case going on in Georgia. You know, where he kidnapped uh, the gardener. So uh, he has his own issues that he should be uh, uh, really, really dealing with. Uh, because you know they might bring his music into the courtroom and use it against him. Yeah, yeah, most definitely. Yeah. You know, and show That's the jury what, what type of character, you know, that, that he's a gangster. Hey, 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 jury, this, this guy. And you know, when he goes to court, he's going to be saying, "Oh no, that's fake. I, I, I ain't really do none of that. I ain't no gangster. Uh, I'm a correctional officer." <laughs> yeah, I, I want rewards. So that's going to be so funny, you know, to, to hear him uh, uh, reverse it, uh, almost like he did in his deposition with us. You know, uh, we asked him had he ever been convicted of a crime, and and he was like. Yeah, I've been convicted of three crimes, and and then my lawyer was like, well, "What was they?" And then he was like, "Oh, when I was a juvenile, I got caught with some marijuana." We was like, "Huh? That ain't no, ain't no felony, motherfucker." <laughs> right, we all got caught with a little weed or something. They smack you on your ass he and see you back to class. He ain't never got caught with no weed. That dude ain't never got caught with nothing. He ain't never had it until he started, you know, uh, uh, rapping. O- only only thing he got caught was was lying. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause I feel like if he if yeah. he had it came right out and just been himself, paid homage, like, cause a lot of, a lot of people took other people's names for their rap shit. He's supposed to pay homage to you, especially when you came home. But see, he, motherfuckers wasn't thinking you was coming home. Is what it was. That was right, the whole right, wrench right. in the program was you coming home. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Whether you was back on the streets, like, claiming the blocks and doing your shit again or doing what you're doing now, that that fucked everything up for the motherfuckers that used the persona that he did, <clears throat> and he got caught in the lie. Now he beef with 50 Cent. He beef with all these other motherfuckers that's pretty much irrelevant to what he need to be. Like you said, what he, he need to worry about what he got going on. And yet he's taking jabs at you.